This video will explain how to turn off comments on your WordPress pages. First, let me explain what the comments look like on your pages. On this page, you'll notice here it's a static web page and individuals are invited to leave a reply to the page. Now, I've left that enabled on this particular site because it makes sense that individuals would be able to respond with questions they have. But on a page like maybe this one, that really just has instructions. I don't need for individuals to be able to respond. And for pages, you'll often like to have no comments on the bottom because you typically don't see an opportunity for individuals to add comments on the bottom of pages. WordPress by default does enable the comments on all of your pages and posts because WordPress is a blogging platform. So you will need to make changes to take off the comments boxes if you want those removed. So in order to do that, you'll go to your WordPress dashboard. There are two different ways that you need to be aware of to turn off the comments. First, you can turn off comments on a page by page basis and you can turn off comments on pages that are already created. So you'll go to your dashboard and click on pages. This will show you all of the pages you've created in your dashboard. And to turn off those comments, you'll simply hover over the page name. You'll click quick edit and then you uncheck the box that says allow comments. That in turn will remove the comment functionality from that page. You'll say update. And then when you look at that page, you'll see that there is no option anymore to comment. So that's for changing existing pages. Now, if you would like to change the settings so that any new pages or posts that are created, you do not want there to be comments, I will explain now how to do that. From your WordPress dashboard, you will go to settings, then you will click on discussion, and up here, you will check off the box that says allow people to post comments on new articles. Now that is already unchecked in this site because I've already gone through and unchecked this box because I don't want people to be able to create on new articles and articles includes pages and posts. So the thing to keep in mind is that if you plan on blogging a lot from your site, the, typically blogging is something that is interactive and you will want people to be able to comment. So you might leave that box checked so that people can comment. But as you create pages within your site, that's where you go ahead and use the quick edit function and edit each page as you would like to allow the comments.